talk about uh, the immune system, the important concepts uh, MSET, AAPMT, GIPMAR, AFMC point of view, I shall put before you. The immune system, it refers to the resistance of the human body against invasion of pathogens or resistance towards the products that are synthesized by pathogens can be called immune system. Father of immunology is Edward Jenner. Edward Jenner is the father of immunology. Now, the main objectives of immune system are recognition and response. Recognition and response are the most uh, important objectives of immune system. Now, the immune system always differentiates between self and non-self cells, differentiates between self and non-self cells and among self cells sometimes they may be altered self cells, altered self cells. So, this ability to distinguish between self and non-self cells that is the cells that enter into the human body from outside environment can be called non-self cells that is foreign cells you know. Then uh, the cells of the human body sometimes they get altered due to invasion of viruses or cancer such cells are called altered self cells. So, it is uh, the main objective of immune system is to differentiate between self and non-self and self and altered self cells and subsequent elimination of non-self cells and altered self cells. Then the types of immunity. Immunity can be divided into two types, you know. The first type is, the first one is innate immunity. The first one is innate immunity, the other one is called um, acquired immunity. Innate immunity is also called natural immunity. The immunity that is there right from the birth of the child here now, it can be called immunity, innate immunity. It is heritable, that is inherited from the parents here now. And the immunity that is acquired during the lifespan can be called acquired immunity. Acquired immunity is again of two types you know, active acquired immunity and passive acquired immunity you know. The innate immunity or the natural immunity or inborn immunity which is also called congenital immunity is also called congenital immunity. Congenital immunity, it is uh, again accomplished by various methods you know. 